Okay, let's work on some hip loosening exercises. It's going to be very important that you loosen up your hips for kicks and everything else you're going to need for stances and all the leg exercises. So let's focus on, again, the hip. So what we're going to do is I'm going to put my hands here slightly above the hip joints. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to bring my legs in, again, shoulder, I mean, stretching them out shoulder length apart. And what I'm going to do is just rotate. Now, what I want to do is make sure I push the hip bone out each time I rotate on each side. I'm pushing the hip bone out. So you're just going to take some flexibility, bend at the knees a little bit, okay, and rotate here. And again, you want to feel that hip joint roll out. So if you don't feel that, it might be a little tough for you, but it's okay to loosen up. That's exactly why we're doing exercise, but roll it out. Make sure it's rolled out. So if you put your hands on the hip joint, you should feel it roll. You feel it almost pop into place. It shouldn't be a bad pop, it's just rolling. You're loosening up the tendons, loosening up some of the, some of the cartilage there, you loosen up the muscles, everything else around that. You fill in your buttocks a little bit, but making sure you go the opposite direction also, rolling the hip the other way. I like to do 50 rotations on each side. So that's 100 rotations total. 50 rotations on each side really gets the hips loosened up so you can start stretching even more intense and kicking more intense and higher.